Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be um, telling you guys, um, how do I want to say this? I'm, I'm just going to be telling you guys my top 10 most recommended movies to watch for Halloween this coming week. So, as we all know, I don't think anybody's going trick or treating, so most of everybody are probably going to be at home with family. I know I'm going to be at home with family, eating candy, and watching scary movies in the dark. Like, I think I did that last year. I haven't went trick or treating in a while anyway, so, like, for me, and probably for, like, older people, too, it's really nothing, like, for teenagers who don't, who don't dress up anymore or who don't even like to go trick or treating. You just go and buy candy and watch scary movies in the dark with friends and family. So, um, if you guys are probably having a hard time, you know, picking out some movies or even if you just want some movie recommendations, I, I have 10 right here for you. So let's just go ahead and get into the video. So coming in at number 10, we have Casper. And Casper came out in 1995. Some of these I might have to date for, some of them I might not. But Casper, I'm not, I'm not gonna tell you guys too much about the movie, it's just a little bit. So Casper is just about this kid ghost and he was like at like a house or something and then like this girl like a human girl she she moved into like the haunted house where casper was that's all i'm gonna tell you i'll link all of them in the description Ooh. i'll link them all in the description so you guys will be able to see it um i probably won't link a trailer but i'll insert images right here right here right here and right there but next, um, coming in at number nine, we have all of the Insidious movies. I actually think there's another one coming out this year, but Insidious is so scary. I actually just watched, I think, the first or second one, like, two weekends ago. It was a while ago, like, a couple weeks ago, I watched it with family. And it was so scary, but it's actually a good movie. And, yeah, this is a good scary movie, especially if you want to be scared straight. This is a very good movie to be scared straight with, okay? Like, I promise you, if you watch this in the dark, you will be frightened. But, like, like this will be, like, a good, like, a scare, like, a good scary movie, okay? It's very good. I, I, rec I really, really recommend um, watching Insidious. And on the scary level... It's up there. It's high on the scary level. So, I'm just, I'm just going to warn you right now. It's pretty scary, especially if you watch in the dark, okay? Probably, oh, and they have multiple movies. Not just one. They, I think they have two, maybe three. But, coming in at number eight, we have Child's Play, which came out in 1988, even though they have newer ones. And actually, I think one came out this year, so you guys can watch that. It's about a doll, a doll male doll but there also is a female version and it goes around killing people and all that stuff hopefully i don't get red marked for this because i'm talking about killing and dolls with knives but it's fine okay but yeah child's play or some people might know it as chucky but it's called child's play i actually did not know um that it was called child's play because when i was writing down my movie recommendations my movie recommendations i had looked up uh chucky and they came up as child's play so yeah it's scary child's level play. it's it's up there with insidious it's just a lot of like killing like kind of like a movie about like a like a dog being a serial killer so it's not that scary but it's a little scary okay Coming in at number three, we, I mean, not the number three, coming in at number seven, we have Hocus Pocus, which came out, Hocus Pocus, which came out in 1988, and it's about these three witches, um, it starts off, like, at this town, where, like, she did, these kids came into her little, which, her little house or cabin or whatever, and they came in, it was messing with stuff, being nosy kids, like, always, and then something happened to the kids, and then the town burned them and all that. And then she put, a, I think they put a curse on the town. And then I think in the future, at that time, it, in the future, she came back and some more kids. You know what I'm getting here, okay? People have probably heard about Hocus Pocus. This comes out on TV year round when Halloween comes. So you probably heard of Hocus Pocus, okay? So oh, it's not that scary neither. It's very low on the scare level. So yeah. Coming in at number six, we have all of the Ghostbusters movies. These are good movies, especially if, especially if, especially if you want to get, you know, that ah, and then that ha 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 ha, like 
a Ghostbusters is considered a Halloween movie. It's a little bit scary for some people. Like, it's more of a funnier movie, but it has that Halloween touch to it, you know? It had, you know, the ghost, all, like, the scary-ish people. I don't know. But it's a Halloween movie. It's considered a Halloween movie, so I really, really recommend it. It's not that scary. It's probably the lowest... It's probably the lowest one on the scariest level. So, yeah. Coming in at number five, we have Edward Scissorhands, which came out in 1998. No, no, 1999. Came out in 1999, and it's about this guy. He, his, his hands are scissors, which it's not really his hands, but it's more like his fingers are scissors. That's all I'm going to tell you. I only watched it once, but it's a good movie, so I recommend it. Coming in at number four, we have Beetlejuice. Well, why did I do that? But we have Beetlejuice, which came out in 1998. No, 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 it didn't. It came out in 1988, okay? 1988, Beetlejuice came out. I only watched that one time, too, so I can't really tell you guys a lot about it. So, I recommend watching Beetlejuice. Let's get a thumbnail. I recommend watching Beetlejuice, so... Yeah, coming in at number three, we're getting down to the needy greedy. Okay, coming in at number three, we have all the scream movies. This is a, this is kind of like Chucky, like a serial killer, like a, a serial killer theme to it. You know, this guy who wears a mask that has like a like a scream emotion, like ah, okay, and he just goes around killing people, and they have a lot of them, and you guys should definitely watch it. Okay, it's up there on the scary level too, okay? Like, especially like the first one, that is the scariest one, okay? So it's, so if you like being scary, if you like those scary, scary movies, the first Scream is the scariest one, and that's that on that, okay? Coming in at number two, we have The Nun, okay? I've, I've heard so many good things about this movie. I haven't watched yet, but I will be watching it on Halloween, okay? The Nun, okay? The Nun, I've... I don't really know what to say about it. I've heard people talk about it, so I recommend watching it, you know. Um, I'm going to watch it, too. So, if you have watched it, comment down below. Is it a good movie to watch, especially on Halloween in the Dark, okay? Coming in number one, we have Strangers 1 and 2. Strangers is this movie about these people who just kill people, too. I only watched the second one, which is the newest one, but I'm going to watch the first one this Halloween. And I, I'm... I'm gonna put a few clips because it's not really like I guess about this movie. This movie is probably one of the scariest Halloween movies I have watched that has like that serial killer thing to it. And this is like probably this is up there with Insidious on a scary level. This, the second one is scary. I haven't even watched the first one, and my uncle says that that's way scarier and way better. So I can't wait to watch that. Um, if you guys have any movie recommendations for me or for anybody else, just put them down, comment down below. Just comment them down below. And if you like this video, um, and me make sure you like this video, um, subscribe. And if you have watched any of any of the movies, or or if you are going to, just give me your feedback down below. Thank you guys for watching this video. I will see you guys on the next one. Peace. <laughs>